Hey, what's up? Today we're doing a You're Bad at Tinder. Tinder, the place where you go to potentially get an STD. Maybe slapped around a little bit. You won't find love, I'll tell you that much. So this is You're Bad at Tinder number 24. Let's do it. Hey, what's up? Oh, what the fuck? Natalie, that is not a good way to show off your beauty. Please send pictures, thank you, and my body is ready. Ready to party. Natalie, you look like you're already partying. You look like you're having a really bad acid trip right now. Just here to catfish men and hopefully get swindled and killed on a date. So you're here to trick men who you're hoping are also trying to trick you into murdering you. So you're gonna be like, surprise, I'm not who I said I was. And he's gonna be like, well, surprise, I was gonna murder you anyway. And then they're gonna have a good laugh about it. And then you'll get murdered. All right, well, I'm going to stab you now. So please don't scream. It only makes it harder on me. Last guy I met on Tinder knocked me up. That baby is his spawn. So you're basically trying to get a Tinder date by being like, the last time I had sex on Tinder, I didn't use protection. Also, I got pregnant and had a baby. Well, she, she's like, going for round two. Yeah, possibly I might have an STD because I let some strange man put his unprotected penis inside me, but... Hey. Oh, wow. Lucas, that is weird. That guy looks like he's ready to go. This is a weird way to portray yourself on Tinder. Someone's got to be into it, right? Oh, it is creeping me the fuck out, though. Moving on. I'm looking for a quick shag, and am fairly easy. I'm up for anything. I'm fairly experimental. I'm most often found in blank, and I'm looking for fellow ear lovers. I may look 13 years old, but I fuck like one, too. Oh, God, that's... Ugh. Makes me cringe. And what do you mean, a fellow ear lover? Like, I love ear play. I just have a really big fetish about ears. Put your ear inside me. Or put something inside my ear. You never have to worry about me walking out on you. He might run over your foot, though. It's nice that he can laugh at his disability. You gotta keep your sense of humor when you have something like this going on in your life. It's important to keep your sense of humor. DTF. That is the simplest profile you can put on Tinder and probably one of the most effective. Just down to fuck. Also, if you put a picture of your head in a toilet, although it could be the other girl who's holding the hair, so I don't know. This is the formula for success on Tinder. Face in the toilet, DTF in the profile. It just makes you seem very attainable. What do you call a kid without arms and legs? Names. You call them names. Oh, that's fucking savage. Sonia? Apparently a stripper. $20 a pick. Six pieces KFC, 30 minute BJ. 12 pieces KFC, one hour 30 minute BJ plus fuck yo dick. 24 pieces KFC, three hour BJ plus fuck yo dick. KFC for a BJ. Can't say I've ever done that, but a three hour BJ, that just seems too long. I understand like having a nice long BJ would be nice, but three hours... Holy shit, I got shit to do. I can't be spending my whole day getting blown. Can't believe I just said that. Three hour blowjob actually sounds fantastic. I take it back. Chelsea, nugget hooker at McPlayboy. College of Nuggets. I secretly am sexually attracted to guys who like to see how many chicken nuggets can fit up their ass. From past experiences, the most I have seen is 16, but there's always room for more. And I'm hoping the next lovely fella I meet will be able to manage at least a box of 20, including the box. Get in my box of 20, bitches. Holy shit. That's a fetish I've never heard of. Challenge accepted. Next video. I'm gonna do the chicken nugget up the ass challenge video. It'll be on my Pornhub, don't worry. So, thanks for watching my You're Bad at Tinder video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, hit that like button, leave a comment down below, let me know what you think. If you have any Tinder profiles or anything, any pictures or any ideas, anything you think I could use for a video, send them to fluffyfanmail at gmail.com. Check out my Patreon, patreon.com slash fluffytalks. And if you haven't already, subscribe to my channel if you like me, you like what I do. And other than that, I will see you guys again really soon with lots more content coming soon. Thanks for watching.